to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. I hope you enjoyed the video from yesterday, the drag strip. Uh, I know we had a good time making it yesterday and we had a good time there. It was fun. If you get a chance to go to South Mountain during Nostalgia Weekend, I highly recommend going. It was a great time. But there's three things that I want to talk about today. One, the Mustang and what's wrong with it now. Two, what I've done to the Titan. And three, I want to review a new bike that I got. First off, what's going on with the Mustang? After we filmed the outro yesterday, we were coming back, we're almost home, and I get smoke coming out of the shifter again, and that is more than likely from my valve covers. Uh, this motor is shot, it's crap, it needs a new one. If you look right there, you can see oil coming out of the breather, and that is overflowing off the valve cover and then down onto the header and causing everything to smoke and carry on. So. I thought I had it fixed because I put different grommets on that actually fit these valve covers. The ones that were on it were round and the ones I needed for it have notches in it. If you can see, this will probably just pop it. There we go. See, it's loose. See, these grommets have the notches in them. The old ones did not. So I put the correct grommets in and it did fix it for a while, but now it's right back to leaking everywhere. And if you look, you can see that these breathers are just full of oil so that just further proves that this engine does have a lot of blow by and needs replaced hopefully hopefully soon I'm, I'm hoping in january february i can order a crate motor for this and get it replaced and i'll probably have the transmission rebuilt and the other thing that happened on the way home was i well it was as i was leaving i pulled my uh, headlight switch out to turn the halos on and the parking lights and my volt gauge dropped down to about 10.9. I push it back in, it'd go up to 12. So I'm pretty sure the alternator shot or the volt regulator is trashed. Either one, I'm just gonna replace both of them. Second thing I wanna to talk to you about is my truck. I just installed probably three weeks ago, an AFE Rebel two and a half inch side exit exhaust. And it sounds great. I love it, I'm very happy with it. Uh, Usually just doing catbacks doesn't give me the sound that I want, but this one actually did and I love the look of it So here it is with a cold start Highway pool plus some revs after it's warmed up and of course the revs are in the truck because right when I was about ready to do it Decided to rain. So here you go with the cold start Hopefully you like the sound of it and if you're thinking about buying one I hope this video helped you in uh, deciding whether to buy one or not uh, I'm very happy with mine third thing I want to talk to you about number three is my new bike and hopefully I'll be doing a review on it once I order another microphone for my helmet because well I can't find my microphone that I had in my helmet so therefore it makes it very difficult to do motor vlogs but here it is here it is, my 2019 Iron 1200. I love this bike. I've been wanting another Sportster for a while, so here it is, check it out. An Arctic White, I believe is the name of the color, with the 70s retro striping on the paint. And yes, this is paint. That is not stickers, it is actually painted. So. I love the black on the white. I think it's a great looking bike. The sound's a little off right now because we're still rocking the stock Harley pipes. Hopefully here soon, maybe after we get the motor in the car, we can uh, buy new pipes for it, hopefully. Hopefully you enjoyed the video of the truck. I hope it sounds good for you. I hope you like it. And I hope it helps you with your decision if you're thinking about buying one for your Titan. You don't forget to hit the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell on for me, please. Give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment. I'll see you next time.